you always look at that empty spot in that chair where, where she should be. She had an empty seat at my wedding because she would have been one of my bridesmaids. As a part of Crime Victims Rights Week. It'll be, it'll be nine years this year. He was a victim of gun violence. Um, that incident also took the life of my aunt and my uncle. The Montana Department of Corrections held an exhibit for the first time at the Missoula County Courthouse. It's called Empty Place at the Table. It's a huge representation. It shows the hole that is missing. I wish that seat wasn't empty. I wish she was here to fill that seat. Participants remembered their loved ones who were victims of violent crime. But he was, he was a very happy dude. There's not a lot that could really get him mad. She was a mom. She was a sister. She was a granddaughter. She was a niece. She was a friend. And each family created a placemat for their loved ones, representing who they were. Uh, just a couple photos of him, stuff um, with the aunt that passed away, a picture of her, him with her. He loved tarot cards. He's a very spiritual dude, so stuff like that. I brought her some flowers and a birthday card. She's very girly. She loved flowers, so. It's a process that was healing for some. I think I want people to get that grief is a hard but necessary journey for a lot of people. Um, this is a really powerful thing that we get to do, and it's a very powerful experience I lived. But I want to display him. I want to show his story off. But still, a reminder of what was lost. We can't even have holidays. When we go to eat, someone will break down or whatever. So now we don't even have holidays. He's someone I wish people got to meet. In Missoula, Claire Peterson, MTN News.